Welcome to Resilient Living, your guide to living comfortably on the earth during these changing times. Imagine using your insulation to hold up the roof and keep your building warm in the winter, cool in the summer. Next, after straw bale buildings, we moved on to structural insulated panels, SIPs. That's a, essentially it's a foam plywood sandwich. You got foam in the middle, plywood on the outsides. And it's very, very strong because of that shape and very lightweight. SIP panels are very tight, whereas the bales um, it never sealed extremely well to the wood. There was always a uh, pass for air to get through them. Um, even after they're plastered, the bales will settle a little bit and leave a gap then. There's basically no studs in the wall. It's just all foam, which makes it a much better insulation. Yeah, the SIP panels, they don't have any thermal bridging. There's nothing but the plywood on both sides. Uh, there's no studs going through there, so the heat has to go through the foam, which it doesn't like to do. Uh, makes a very high performance tight uh, building. Air doesn't want to go through it either. It seals up nice and tight. Just imagine if the heat was actually water in a bucket. And most of the bucket is good, but you have a hole every 16 inches. It's not going to hold for a long time. And that's the same thing with the heat. Resilient Living is brought to you by Happy Dancing Turtle, helping you and your friends live a resilient life.